comes to developing economies, what is usually referred to as low and middle income economies, it's very important to understand that prenatal care has to be different. You can stratify and say, okay, basic scan, okay, referral scan, possibly okay, tertiary care, and the patient goes from step one to step 1A, step 1B, step 2, step 2A, step 2C, step 2F, and then step 3. Can we afford that in pregnancy? And the answer is no. We need to give as many answers as possible in the point of first care when it comes to prenatal care. Can we do this because everybody's an expert? No, not possible. Can we do this because everybody's a beginner? And that is now possible. How is it possible? It's possible because you combine human skill with artificial intelligence. And you use what is available on a machine to stratify there and then whether this patient can go home and be happy and deliver, or this patient needs additional attention from a highly specialized fetal medicine specialist. And this is where I put Sonia today, at least in my part of the world, where we must ensure that everybody gets optimal care. They don't waste time, they don't waste money, they get the best care when they need it, and they get ideal care because of artificial intelligence when they don't need anything more. So it's not the sophisticated bits that are important. What is important is the basic bits, and that is the true place of AI. The expertise of thousands of people, thousands of minds, put into artificial intelligence, put into a machine that does this hard work for you at a reasonable cost, because that is cost saving in the long run. That is why I am so fond of Sonia, and I think it is the future. Thank you indeed.